um, I've played on the channel before and it has proven to be quite popular amongst you all. So, I figured, hey, why not make another video playing it? And that is a game that I believe is called Shut. say that one, two, four, seven, and nine are open, whereas three, five, six, and eight are shut. Let's open them all, though. Now all of them are open. This is how we begin the game. All nine numbers open. And we have this little where these die come in, or is it one die, two dice, I can't remember, these dice come in. With these two dice, we will take shots, rolling the dice, trying to roll specific numbers, and we roll it onto this felt, like so.
because we have rolled a three, we must put down anything that can make three, or these two numbers, or anything else that can be, you know, made up to make three. Now, obviously, in this case, the only thing we can do is either put down the three, or put down the two and the one, like so. If we had rolled, let's say, I don't know, a seven, a four, and a three, there's a lot more possibilities that we could do. We could straight go with the seven on its own. We could do what the die say and put down a four and a three. But seven's quite a popular number. You could go with six and one, five and two, and you can even do more than you know, just two combinations, you could do three numbers that make seven. So for example, four, two, and one, that makes seven. So I hope that makes sense in how you shut the numbers. Now the object of the game is to try and shut all numbers without rolling a combination that is not possible to do. So for example, you're at row to five. Let's go, let's just put down the five. We'll call this our practice game. We'll roll again. We've rolled an eight, so we could go six and two, or anything else that makes an eight. I quite like the idea of six and two, though I think that I had a good choice there. Let's roll the die again. I told you sevens are pretty popular. <laughs> um, what should we do? Should we just put down the seven on its own? I think so. Four and three though, we could have done that too. Let's go again. So it would be nice to maybe get an 8 or a 9 here. Try and get rid of some of the high numbers. Gosh, another 7. Well, we have no choice but to put down the 4 and the 3 here. So now this could be where we're about to lose. Unless we roll an 8, a 9. Let's see, what shall we get with the die? And of course we get another 7, so here there is nothing we can do because all combinations to make 7 have been moved, or are now shut. So we have lost, and our total score would be the sum of the numbers that are left. So, 9 plus 8, 17 plus 1 is 18, so we would finish on a score of 18, which is really not too great. That's why maybe getting rid of the high numbers early on is quite good as a tactic, if you can't win. However, tight, as I'm going to be making a video where I'm going to try and make you sleep, I'm going to try and get at least one win whilst you're dozing off to sleep, 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 sleep. So let's go again. Let's roll these die in your ear. In your ear. Your left ear. Let's do one hand at a time. What do you know? Another seven. Let's put down the seven on its own. We'll go again here. that we 
course, quite useful. Um, or we could do 6, 4, and 2 and get rid of 3 numbers in 1. score for us. 8 plus 3 is 11, so 11 is going to be our, I mean, we say high score, but technically, 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 technically we're going for a low score. Technically. So let's go again. Um, 
no, we couldn't have, so either way, um, four and a six, ten, yeah, we would have ended up with a ten either way, so that's still better than eleven, I mean, each game we're getting a better and better score, maybe we're starting to slowly work out the tactics, because there's got to be some sort of strategy or logic to this that I just can't seem to work out. And in the other videos, I think I sort of work it out as I go, but I still never properly know what the strategy actually is. <laughs> Alrighty, let's go. Let's roll one at a time here. Let's go first time. One, second time. Another three. Let's just put down the three. I feel like the one and the two are super useful because with any of these other numbers, just by adding a one or a two to it, you can pretty much make any other number. So they're very, very useful. Let's go one die at a time again. Plus three is seven. So let's put down, let's just go over the seven. Get rid of a high number. Let's see, a two and a six. Do I just go over the two and the six here? Nah, let's put down the eight. Feels like it could be a bit pesky. A bit pesky, a little bit pesky, you know, a little bit pesky, a little pesky, eight. Roll number four, six, and two is eight. I'll list time, I'm going to go with six and two. And right now, we are on a score of 19, so if we can get rid of that nine, we have tied our score from the last game. In fact, a 9 would be very good. I like the array of numbers we have left. Um, by the way, I thought I should let you know, if you end up in the position where every number is closed except a 1, you get rid of one die, and you just roll 1. Because, obviously, there's no way of making 1 with 2 dice. So, you would just roll one. Hope that makes sense. All right, let's see if we can get a nine or maybe a ten here. Would be quite good. A six. Six works. It's not ideal, but five plus one. That's what the die are recommending. <laughs> and we have a four and a nine here, so thirteen. Well, that means we must roll a 9, or we must roll a 4 on this turn. Let's take a look. Oh, okay, we need to get a 5. <laughs> Damn it. What is with these 10s and 11s today? They're really not liking us, are they? So that was a score of 13, still a little bit higher than our 10 that we just got. Let's play a few fast games here. I'm going to go for the 8. Uh, let's go again. 9. Oh, let's get rid of that 9 while we can. I like this star. Got rid of the 8 and the 9 right off the first two rolls. And a 4. Um... Let's just put down the four. Another four. Well, we have no choice. But we have some middle numbers here to get rid of. Let's see if we can do it. Five. Okay, we're on a score of 15 right now. That's not great, so end of that game with a score of 15. Will we beat 10? Will we get a win? Who knows? Seven. All right, let's try. 
try something a bit different. This probably won't work, but let's start with a four, two, and one. Put down as many numbers as we can. Of course that does accumulate to the number seven. And of course another seven, here we have to go. Seven. Ten. Okay, I like that. Um, or do I? We can't even make it. <laughs> Here's me like, oh yeah, that's good. We can get rid of one of the high scores. But no, we, we can't even make ten. That's like the highest score we've got. What's that? 17, 20, 31. Oh, yikes. Okay, so putting down lots of numbers is maybe not the best strategy. 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 But we'll, we'll put down the 9, though. If we if we roll a 9 on the first go, we put down the 9. It's been... The, the 8 and the 9 have been the difficult ones for us. Uh, what do we do with a 12? Let's have a think. I like the idea of eight and four, maybe. Let's go again. Eight, eight, eight. You try six and two, maybe. Seven. I 
would have put the seven down. And then I have a one in six chance of winning. Let's see. Will it take me six rolls to get it? Five. Six. No, so it would have been pretty, pretty unlikely. So I think, I think I made good choices in that game. And uh, I'm really glad that uh, I managed to win a game in this video. And I think uh, that is where I will bring this video to an end. So I really hope that you all did enjoy this relaxing shot the box video. It is such a little fun game. I love little games like this sort of, you know, puzzle, logic-based games where you have to try and just even, you know, just on your own solve a little thing and like this is so nice and neat. You could just bring this on holiday with you or whatever and if anyone knows any other games similar to this, please let me know because I would love to make a video playing it. Um, and if you want to check out more ASMR shut the box like this and you haven't seen the other videos of me playing it Be sure to go and check them out um, On the channel. I think I've done like a one hour long version uh, I've done a video where it's like the video ends as soon as I get a win So <laughs> you can kind of see how long that is and interpret how long it takes me to get the win And a couple more I've done some shorts YouTube shorts playing the game as well. It's so much fun and I've even played it on stream So if you want to see me play it on stream, let me know um, And uh, yeah, I want to thank you all so much for watching. I hope you have enjoyed if you have be sure to leave the video a Big thumbs up. I hope that you have been able to fall asleep sleep 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 That was my goal to help you sleep and if not then I have failed in which case, just play the video from the start again. <laughs> that helps out me as well. <laughs> Thank you all so much for watching. Hope you're all doing well. Sleep well. <laughs>